Hey people from YouTube, which are here and today I'm be showing you guys how to install the Little Blocks mod. Um, the Little Blocks mod is pretty cool. My little brother actually showed me it and it was quite interesting, so I thought I would show you guys how to install it for yourselves. Um, so to start off, what you need to do is download the link in the description to be given a folder called the Little Blocks AIO. Um, so all you do is open it up, highlight everything in here, and drag and drop it to your desktop. What it does is it saves you the hassle of having to go to three, three or two links to download all the parts and whatnot. Just it just saves you time. Um, as usual, I'm gonna save the little blocks here because I need to upload it for you guys. Um, now here's the catch: if it's 1.2.5, then ignore what I'm about to say. But if it's not, then open up this README file here and download each one of the folders here from these links. Um, this will just get you the most updated version. Then you can continue using the video like you normally would. Um, if not, then just delete the README and pretend you didn't see it. Um, so what you do now is to start, just here in the bottom left, just type in percent app data percent, enter, go into your dot Minecraft, into your bin folder. Now right here you'll see a folder called Minecraft, or not a folder, but a file. You'll right click that and open with WinRAR. And then there you go, you always delete your meta in folder, that's always the first thing you gotta do. Once that's deleted, you start off by opening up Mod Loader on your desktop or wherever you saved it to. In my case, it's on the desktop. So I'll just right-click and select all, drag and drop it into your Minecraft.jar, like so. Once that's done, just close Mod Loader, open up Mod Loader MP, right-click and select all, drag and drop it into your Minecraft.jar like we did previously, close Mod Loader MP, and now, last but not least, open up Little Blocks, and right click and select all and just drag and drop again OK close and then there we go we're good so now we can just delete all this stuff now I will show you guys that it works just by simply making sure you don't get a black screen I'll just log in real quick and show you guys um, that it's working so yeah we'll just do that now so you just log in oh as you can see as usual uh, we didn't get a black screen um, but there shouldn't be a problem. If you guys do get a black screen, please just go ahead and leave me a comment. Don't be rude about it or I won't help you, but if, if you do just leave a comment saying, hey, it didn't work, I'll probably comment back to you or you can give me a PM or something. But, uh, yeah, so it worked. Our game didn't crash or implode or kill sheep or spawn zombies everywhere or do something retarded that it would do if it crashed. Um, clearly it's working, so, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. As usual, uh, if you want to help me out, if the video helped you, give me a like and, you know, subscribe to me. And then, yeah, I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. I'll see ya.